Good morning, Ash. You know, a lot of small businesses are hurting right now, so online sales can really make a difference. And Heartwares here is part of the nonprofit Art with a Heart, where those online sales can make a difference in someone's life. Heartwares is a store which sells unique works of art, but as part of the nonprofit Art with a Heart, there are some things you can't put a price on. Because Art with a Heart was, since I, since I found out about it, has always been a way for me to, like, not necessarily forget the things around me, but for me to tune them out for a while and just gather my thoughts. They're teaching things like communication skills, coping skills. They're learning about identity and goal setting. We do things like financial literacy and mock interviews to prepare them for careers. And then they're building a community while they're here. But since COVID restrictions limit the number of people who can gather in person, Art with the Heart program director Christina Rawls says the community is now a virtual one. We still impacted over 100 youth this year virtually. But it really doesn't replace that in-person connection that we used to have. We really are a safe space for people. People what like 25-year-old Art with a Heart apprentice, one, Matthew Smith. Uh, they helped with job interview skills, which uh, at the time I hadn't really had too much experience when I first got involved. So that definitely helped me. And now it's putting Smith on a path to fulfill his dreams of becoming a graphic artist. Also learned how to do different styles of art because usually what I did was mostly just drawings and just sketches. Now I actually get to work with clay, uh, glass to make mosaics. But because of the pandemic, Heartworks has been able to keep only a few apprentices in the shop. One of our biggest values is community engagement. It's a real loss for my program, Heartworks. Despite the COVID restrictions currently in place, the program already has done a lot for young people like Smith. I didn't tend to really talk to people as much, but just being there, getting the, the energy that I got from the place that allowed me to open up and talk to people more and converse with people over art more. We really do believe in the power of art as a way to, to cope and really empower individuals. Now, you can still shop Heartwares online, but at this point, your purchases probably won't arrive in time for Christmas, so you just have to tell your loved ones that their gift is in the mail. We're live in Hamden, Mark Roper, WMAR2 News.